Styles Phenomenal versus Glorious in a Falls Count Anywhere matchup. And honestly, I usually go with the champion, but Bobby Roode got done dirty in the Battle Royal when I used him. And I'm not totally happy about it. So I think to uh, get some redemption, I think Glorious will have to put the hurting on Phenomenal. <laughs> Alright. The best part is I can sing the Glorious song on air again. That would be awesome, right? Uh, you know, I do want to say something. After that. Um... The one thing I hate about these new Titantrons, honestly, the one thing I hate about these new Titantrons is this. Why is there no Titantron movie anymore? You know, I understand that in other parts of the game, like because some people don't have like that type of top Titantron. People, um, you know, you know, they have their Titantron in the game. It's hard to explain unless you play the game. But um, I'm not. I don't know. Like I was never really a huge fan of this Titantron. Like how it just says the same thing over and over again. It's like not even. I don't know. Because the one thing I love about WWE or wrestling in general was is the Titantron, and even though sometimes the Titantron is better, or it's actually it's at its best when it comes to WWE level production. Um, I don't know. They just don't use it anymore. Do they even show it on like the big um, score board thing on top of the arenas anymore too? That's what I want to know. I mean, I don't know. I, I just always really loved the tit watching the Titantron. Now I don't get to do that anymore, which I'm kind of bummed about. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. Everybody get along and sing it with me. Glorious. No, I won't give in. I won't give in till I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. I don't give a shit if I'm embarrassing, my, embarrassing myself on YouTube. I fucking love that song. There is not one song in WWE that makes you want to sing more than the glorious th song of Bobby Roode. Like, I fucking love that. Like, when Bobby Roode debuted, everybody fucking sang that song. And it was the most hyped fucking thing I've ever heard. I was like, oh my god, this is awesome. I love how they even got the he even they even put in the little turntable thing of but his that's awesome. And his opponent from Toronto. I mean, like I always say, Bobby Roode is by far one of my favorite TNA wrestlers of all time. When it was called TNA, but no, seriously though, Bobby Roode is like one of, honestly. His as much as I hated him during his World Championship run, he had. I fucking loved his matches. Like I saw, I think I saw on YouTube that they actually just showed it. They actually just showed it recently on Impact. They showed this match with him and James Storm when they when Beer Money broke up. I think it was at Bound for Glory or Slam Anniversary or something, and they just fucking destroyed each other, and it was great. I love a good street fight, but that was awesome. Now, speaking of poor TNA, I mean you watch stuff like that when their arenas were they were able to fill pretty decent sized arenas and then you watch fucking TNA now and it's like there's like what a couple hundred people in the crowd that's kind of sad I don't know let's let's put it this way folks TNA is practically or impact is practically dead I'm just watching it until it eventually does die because I mean they have some pretty good wrestlers like fucking Eli Drake their world champion I, I love Eli Drake he's a fucking great heel he's a great personality he's a really good wrestler you know you know I just uh, it's just Ladies not it's TNA is not what it used to be man, I never it's just, and it's a shame watching these guys compete.
The buzz in the air here in Baltimore. Got Bobby Roode here putting the uh, hurting on the United States champion, AJ Styles. This is not for the championship, although I wish it could have been. I didn't think to make it a title match. Because let's be honest, this is a tight This is a like a. This is like a TNA fucking match. It's out here, Although it's pretty no fucking outs. cool. Tell us about AJ Styles. Come to think of it, I think as AJ Styles has beef with him, Bobby Roode, because he beat his longest guy. reigning TNA this championship reign. And then Bobby Roode beat that reign, and now he's the longest TNA pun. champion. Why do people say no pun intended when they clearly intend the pun? It's so idiotic. <laughs> fucking Corey Graves is all salty and shit on their commentary. Honestly. Honestly, Corey Graves is the best thing about this commentary team in this game. Honestly, the fact that he is a commentator is like the greatest thing ever. Him shitting on Saxton all the time is fucking phenomenal. No pun intended. Although, of course, the pun was clearly intended, which makes me an idiot. <laughs> and going back to what Corey Graves was saying. Hey guys, did you just notice something? Bobby Roode kind of looks like Triple H. Triple H uses a sledgehammer. Bobby Roode's using a sledgehammer. Doing some more yeah. Damage here. <laughs> what the hell? I think I just entered. I think I just entered the Matrix. I think I just entered the Matrix. AJ oh, let's get outside the ring here. Ow. God, my nose is so stuffy from when I started recording. Jesus. Nice kick out. Got the reversal. I get the fuck out of here. That Fuck off, AJ. That wasn't even Ow. Close, Motherfucker. Oh, not the apron. God damn it. He's on the oh, defensive shit. here. I fully expect him to Ow. bounce back, though. This is the type of one on one atmosphere where he flies. Will you fuck off. Sure he's Thank some you. Punishment here, but given how much he prefers to be on the outside of the ring, he can very spine well change the outlook of the match with one Bam, spine buster. buster. Another thing down, that guys. Triple H uses Your as a signature move. After a move like that. Let's put it this way. Triple H... I mean, Bobby Roode was TNA's Triple H. Ooh, I got the bat. I love the bat. Oh, he's really taking it to him. Man, this Let's put it this way. This match is going to be pretty easy, too, to get at least four and a half stars on. Because, you know, with how the VC I'm shit is in this game, here, it's kind bro. of fucking impossible to get anything out of your matches. 2K. Hits with the clothesline. Fucking shitty development team. Don't get me wrong, I enjoy this game when I play it, but Still fucking 2K has made here. some awful, awful right decisions now. with this game. I think I'm gonna put him through the fucking table. With the glorious DDT. I'm gonna do that. Because I can. AJ Styles is fired up in this one. But what the hell? Oh. Is he do it? Do it. Come on. Glorious. And he lands Ow. a savage elbow. Wow. That was Missed funny by though. A mile. Had that one well scouted. Not so fast. Glorious. I love that. Ow, motherfucker. Whoops, not even close. Oh my god. What was he thinking? Get in the get the fuck off me. No, there's get the right. Nah, let me get your ass up. Come on. Hurry the fuck up. Jesus. This superstar is so happy with this week's power rankings. I'm told they've been no shit. and now hang over the mantle ah, in his house. Full Nelson He's slam. After it while he had the energy, smart move. I'm gonna try and drag him over to the announce table so I can put him through. He's making a statement here. Really? Right when I bring it over to him. Get the fuck off me. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Reverses that one. Oh my god, Not I just want to put you through the table. Why? And there's that scissors takedown, commonly known as the Hurricane Rana. Great I like when it was a lot easier to put people through tables in this game. Oh, 
he's able to reverse it. What the hell is this? What the hell is this thing like fucking? Wait, what the fuck? Oh, I thought I was going to be able to do it. it. Glorious DDT on the floor. Although it's not over yet. Look at the replay. I want nice to do it through the table. Right I really want to do it through the table. Oh, like AJ's being a little bitch right now. Arnie's one step ahead on that one. While this is clearly a great matchup, I can go back and watch this superstar. Oh my god. Match yep, there we go. That's what I was looking That's for. How good it was. Glorious ET time. Bam! Right through the table. Not today, buddy. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry. Not to get today. I just don't think he it could be over here. One, two. Holy shit, he kicked out. What's it gonna take to keep this guy down? What the bloody hell was that? Doing some Sit down. damage here. Michael, that is so dangerous. Fuck He's off. Sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Jesus Christ. I don't know how he kicked out of that. Bobby Roos. Fisherman Buster. Fisherman suplex. AJ's in big trouble now. Oh man, AJ Styles is in trouble. Back into oh, the shit. Floor. You want to put this in the ring now? I see how it is. No reverses it. Glorious DDT. We shall do it again, my friends. Here glorious. The glorious DDT. Did I get the pin? Yes, I did. It's over. One. Two. What the fuck? I guess AJ is one of those guys that kicks out of literally everything. The unfortunate reality is he might not get up, which would all oh, the sledgehammer connects. I'll scramble your insides. What happened? I'm not getting any points for hitting people with Showing weapons anymore. Clearly looking to incapacitate fuck, his dude. opponent here. We're like trying to send him to a local like, seriously. facility. You can't fucking do it. You can't get VC any other way. You can't get points any other way to fucking get full of five stars. Shit. People still buzzing about this superstar's last match, and with good reason. What an amazing contest. The fuck? Oh, he turns it around. Swing and a miss. That was strike one, two, and three. Ain't no stopping him now. What the hell is he doing? Bobby Roode with the uh, elbow there. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. Strong Irish whip, just too much here. Get the signature on him. Spine buster. shattering spine buster. That was glorious. This one is over. Dude, fuck, did he really just say that was glorious? Jesus Christ. There he goes, crashing to the floor. There's one other thing I haven't done yet in this game that I really this. love to do. Oh, the first thing he needs to do is get back to his feet. And that is spearing them through the fucking barricade. And apparently, I can't do that because this game wants to be a piece of shit. Don't you fucking do it. Great Fuck job off. Escaping, trying to turn this thing around. And it's reversed. Ugh, God, I just want to fucking spear you. Ah, oh, not this shit again. Fuck it. I think we're at the point in this match where the finisher could be used at any moment here. I'm gonna just try and fucking get away from him. That's all I want to do. I gotta say, I hate the fact that you can't run in the crowd. Rankings, I that that annoys the shit out of me. No way this superstar deserves such a favorable ranking. Ow! Fucker. Alright, wanna play it like that, eh? For him, guys. Yeah, he's on Dream Street. 
Alright, now I got him. He's mine. What the fuck? He may be in the best physical condition. Oh, I've ever I seen can't him do it on here. I can't do it on there. Shit. I wish I could tell you guys what this superstar thinks oh of God, this week's power rankings, but when I ask, the only thing Get I got fucking wrecked. No comment. I guess I, I guess the only way you can spear somebody now is through the barricade on this side. Both these superstars appear to be operating on That's fine. Here, guys. I don't mind. This is going to be a long ass fucking match. Uh I guess the spear through the barricade isn't going to work. What do I have to Please do work. Let me Irish with you. I don't know as a WWE nope. superstar if you ever have those thoughts of self doubt. That'll Full Nelson slam by fight. Rude. You know what? Fuck this. He's focusing on the face now. Man, AJ's just getting his fucking ass whooped. I told you it was glorious versus phenomenal. So, why is it not popping up? I give up. I give up. Glorious. Fuck it. Might as well finish it off while it, I can. I got two finishers. What's the worst he can do, right? My God, AJ, are you that fucking hurt? No, he's not. I almost got myself into a very bad situation. Physical than I thought it would be. Bobby Roode with a kick. It's over. If it's not over in this in this finisher, I'm gonna be a little shocked. I still have another one, but I still think I should I should pin him. One, two, three. Bobby Roode wins. Glorious match. Whew. Apparently, they took away one of my favorite things to do in this game, and that was the uh, spearing through barricades. I mean, how many times I, did I have to put him through shit? I, I fucking put him through a table. I put him... I DDT'd him on the floor. I mean, I DDT'd him in the ring. And then I DDT'd him in the ring again. I mean, what more does a guy have to do? I, I don't know. I mean, am I going crazy or... Shit. Either way... Yeah, Bobby Roode wins. He's not only the it factor, but he's also glorious. But that was a hell of a match, I have to say. That's probably one of my favorite. Um, that was probably one of my favorite uh, Faultless Kind Anywhere matches I've done. I'm going to be honest. So, that being said. I guess hopefully Raw can uh, stack up because I don't know who do you guys think is winning in this whole brand split thing that I'm doing. I mean, not for nothing, but I've done the brand split this entire time. But ever since I've been playing WWE games, buddy, you know, who do you think is winning? Who do you think has had the better matches? I'd like to know. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.